Hello friends, in this video, I'll show you how in TWS platform of interactive brokers, you can see the estimated range of an asset in future based on its implied volatility. So in order to do that, you will have to make sure that on the chart, the asset does have its underlying options. Next, what you'll have to do is go to edit and then click on chart parameters. And over here, you'll see an option of estimated price range. Make sure that it's checked just like I have done. So the estimated range is derived based on the implied volatility and these standard deviations will give us the range in terms of what's the probability for an asset to be in a certain range. For standard deviation one, that probability would be 68.27%. For standard deviation two, it will be 95.45%. And for standard deviation three, it will be 99.73%, which means there are, in a very crude sense, 99.73% chances for an ascent to be trading into this range in future. So let's just apply for now standard deviation one. And we, again, we make sure that this box is checked over here. And the other consideration is you make sure the asset that you have open on your chart for which you want to see the estimated price range does have options on it. If it does not have options trading on it, then this estimated price range function will not work obviously because these standard deviations and the estimated ranges are computed based on options and their implied volatility. So once you have selected the standard deviations, click on apply and then OK. You see no difference right now on the chart, but you see a very small arrow here on the right hand side at the bottom. If you can just follow my cursor, if you would click on it and drag this blue arrow like this, it will show you the estimated price range. So we are looking at CBA, the Commonwealth Bank of Australia traded on Australian Stock Exchange, ASX. The estimated one standard deviation price range for CBA as of 10th of August is roughly from 116 to $99. So that's the range in which you can expect the CBA to trade with a probability of 68%. Again, where did the 68% come from? From here, the standard deviation that we picked. Now, if we change it to, let's say three, which means there are 99.73% chances for the stock to trade in the given range on the chart. And what that given range is, if we again applied it, then we see that the range has actually broadened considerably. That is all the way from say $80 to $133. So that's how you can see the estimated price range of any asset, given that it has options trading over it. So I hope you found this video useful. If you want me to cover any of the other functions of Traders Workstation, the trading platform by Interactive Broker, just let me know in the comments and I'll cover that. Thank you.